were gone, I'd work for all my life, and I had to start again with just my children and my wife. I thank my lucky stars to be living here today, cause the flag still stands for freedom, and they can't take that away. Cause there ain't no doubt I love this land God bless the USA
name? Dusty Hill. Dusty, tell me something. That was you had a good run going there. You had a little bit of a slip. What happened? Ah, uh, I believe my legs were going faster than my body could keep up with. So <laughs> you felt that happen because you were on a good run there. Yeah. No. No. I mean, I was just trying to get up there as fast as I could and come down the same, do everything smooth. Yep. You know, it just sometimes it happens like that. You know. How time did you get? Uh, 28, uh, 43. That wasn't bad. Did he give you any yeah. bucks on that? No? Uh, yeah, I got a two-point gig for right. the slip. slip. Okay. Yeah. Right. yeah, but everything else, you know, I'm, I'm pretty happy with my transact, there my transition, go. and everything, everything else went pretty smooth. Things like that happen? Oh, yeah. You yeah. learn from it. <laughs> yes, you Good do. Good luck for the rest of the day. Thank you so much. British uh, climbing is a little bit different. They consists of a safety harness around the pole at all times. They have to conform with the uh, legislation and regulations laid down by the country. So even if they're competing and they're not in Great Britain, they still have to abide by what the uh, rules and regulations are. It takes them a little bit uh, longer to get up, but uh, again, they feel they're much, much safer by that, by that uh, using that particular method. <laughs> Well, that's just about it for another year at the 23rd International Linesman's Rodeo. I'd like to extend my thanks to Chad Augenbright and Bright Eyes Features for all the help and assistance in this production. Also, the entire committee, an army of volunteers, for all their help and assistance in uh, the entire week that, that we've been involved on here. I'd also like to extend my thanks to the sponsors for the continued support. Most of all, a special thanks goes out to each and every one of the competitors who have traveled in some cases thousands of miles to come here and compete today. These are the men and women of the electricity industry who take time off to show us what they do best in the most outrageous conditions in the most outrageous places on the face of this earth. They're always there to make the impossible possible. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to thank you all. And thank you from me, Mike Braven, for joining us on this feature. Bye-bye.